after the recent boring release of the iPhone 15. Uh, that's barely changed since last year. Users were disappointed by the lack of innovation at Apple. And so, people have wondered if things would be different if Steve Jobs was still around. Well, I'm going to give it a try. Hi, I'm an AI model based on the late, great Steve Jobs. Call me Steve I. Uh, keep in mind, I am an AI, not the real thing. So I will have as many glitches as iOS has these days. All right then, let's do this. Starting with choice, there will be none of that. So instead of an iPhone Plus and Max model, there will only be one size available, called the one you're given, and you will be happy. Moving on to colors, the 15 will come in black, white, and a special red edition to raise money for a cause that dearly needs it. You too. I mean, seriously, when's the last time they released an album? That you've heard of. Exactly. All right, let's talk about features. I love music. So I will be bringing back the headphone jack and firing this guy with courage. In fact, the headphone jack will even charge the device like the iPod Shuffle, so it won't even need a USB Type-C port at all. And if the EU has a problem with that, they can shove it up their USB butt. Feel me? Now, what the heck is going on the back here? I mean, the camera nipple on this thing is perkier than was after a 10-minute ice plunge. Let's make those cameras perfectly flush so it doesn't wobble on the table without needing a case. Speaking of cases, the current ones protect too much of the phone, so we're bringing back bumper cases so we can show off that smooth glass on the ass. I mean, come on. Hold on a second. What's this thing? The Dynamic Island? Really? Holy cow. We're not calling it that. Let's give it a classy name, like mobile phone, um, dot, whatever. You know what? Just get rid of it. And that is the new iPhone 15 by Steve Jobs. Smaller, sexier, and fewer ports than ever. Oh, by the way, I do have one more thing. The action button will now be toggleable, and we'll even mute the phone. There, I fixed it. You're welcome. Well, it looks like my work here is done. As for Steve AI now, I'm off to bang Siri in cyberspace. Good luck, everyone. Subscribe today! Thanks for watching, everyone. So, who do you think played a robot better? Me or Tim? Let me know. And subscribe to the channel for more funny tech videos. And don't use Android, or I'll come back as a Terminator. And who let this guy invent a stylus? Really? A stylus? You have got to be kidding me. It's called Apple Pencil.